Hi, my name is Siddhipon Panvilai. Today, I come to show you my latest project, Quit. Quit is Twitter client developed using Qt and Qt Mobility APIs by Nokia. As you can see, the UI was well designed to be nice and easy to use. You can add multiple Twitter accounts as many as you want. For now, I have two of mine, and you can add more if you, if you want. Okay. When you click on your Twitter account icon, the timeline will be loaded. There are three timelines, friend timeline, mention timeline, and direct message timeline. Each timeline has different background color. Moreover, if you have new message, the background will be highlighted with different color. In the meantime, there will be notification icon show how many unread messages you have. You can also able to click on the timeline icon on main menu, and the selected timeline will be shown. To tweet new message, just select option and new tweet. And then send. Now refresh. Yeah. The timeline support kinetic scrolling, so I'm so sure that you will have a great experience on using Quit. You can reply, use read, or direct message easily by click at the timeline and select, for example, reply. And then, send. Quit support many screen size. You can use it in both portrait and landscape mode. Everything works in the same way. And sure, Quit also supports the button based device. You will see that it is faster than touch device, yes, because um, the button based device has a smaller screen. Everything is has the same functionality as the touch device. You can add Twitter account as many as you want. You can check the timeline. You can change the tab by place one or two or three. Go to top, go to bottom. You can also able to go to the timeline you want from the main menu by piece 1 or 2 or 3 
One more thing, if the method has been embedded with geolocation information, you can see it via Google Map. And don't worry, Quit support not only new phone models, but also old phone models. Quit now fully support on Series 60 device and will be support on Memo device soon. Thanks for your attention.